What's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today we will talking about how to add a new editor into Angular 2 application. So let's get started. I'm open the project in WebStorm. So I I decided to paste a tiny MCA. Sorry, my son wake up. Okay, I'm back now. So I decided to paste a tiny MCA editor and add to the body of the post content so we need to take a look at the documentation and integrate with all the projects we are going to and install Okay, so we add and scrape into the Angular CRI Structure inside and CRI. So in scrape, scrape here and save it. And now add the typing in type print dot d dot ts in okay type in dot d dot ts okay and say and now in the max so at cpr dot we copy the model in, into our sets by just model dot x c dot ok and copy then you can see in our set we have skin here and now Now we need we will make a new component by to okay now I'm going to general new component by ng general component in a so. I'm going to create a new folder by helper. Sorry, helper. Helper. Go in helper and editor. Come on an app helper. It should be 
Uh, find it. Yes, we have an editor here, but in Westlaw it doesn't read really loss. Sign up up up. So quiz and. Uh, okay, we have editor here and modify a bit. In app editor, will be change to editor. And import component on destroy after even in this from Angular. Import copy this for real quick. Force for on in this component and on destroy uh, after a uh, view in this uh, even emitter and input output. Okay. So we can remove this for now. Just paste a comma here. And component should let the templates URL now. Templates in touch area. And we'll be adding. ID will be will be element ID element ID element ID will need to variable inside of app editor component and by element ID now be element ID element id it will be input input so element id will be input input element id this will be just string and output on key key up on editor key up and we have output editor key up will emitter even emitter will be any new even emitter any corpus input input and now editor and copy that and post here okay so we have an assets library Key up on key up right there. Okay. Okay. So now in now I'm going to restart um Angular app. Only 
this implement after building this after after viewing this viewing it after on the choice and now I'm open local house Copy that. Okay, you have a block and log out, and I'm going to log in with admin. So we have a block, uh, uh, sorry, crest block post. Right now we have body in our plan types only. Now we need to integrate and delete and share by body. So in the block and block in post form, we have a post form component. Now we'll be take area. Area. Now we'll be released now remove it by we have an editor component will be intact selector for example now test editor tag will be tag editor and now mm, test editor and we have an input Input will be element ID. Now, input element ID will be equal to pass body, right? And outputs, outputs of uh, outputs on editor key up. On editor key up. On editor key up. Output now we buy this function when we, as user enter the text. And now we be called the function um, on body chain. On body and body text. Editor, what it is key up with even, even okay. So I'm going to create a new function in body on body editor key up in uh, will be in part form component and see in it okay with um even now i'm going to just control the slug even um the touch is change even now see so we have a editor here and now i'm going to Write something here. Hey, yeah. Yeah, we got the text input here. How are you doing? Okay, so so one stage from body change. So we need to set to this those parts this body will be equal to even. For example, we can change the text value to easy to understand by stage value now I will remove this console so that means when user have finished uh, writing and some text here and we could also also save the parts with the body 
now I'm going to save the content here by um, that with a um, rest editor now will be slow run and copy that for real quick so I can make the first uh, or several this will be strong and crisp now you can see one thing I will show you the body fold we we display in port detail is a pass body here but angular will be not display HTML tag so how we display HTML tag here by inner HTML HTML I'm not sure it will be right right um, pause dot body and remove this now I'm saving again cool so we can able to display HTML tag here now when going to edit this post click by click edit and we will see an error will be block is not correct pass in skin setting so how we fix that so in editor component we should be now we need to variable here by base url equal will be string and equal slash and skin url will be this dot base url plus so now it should be automatic refresh okay here we go so one thing we need to face the problem by we have a visit post with the body content but when we click to edit we don't have a default value set here so how we do that so simply in the editor component we define a new input inputs will be default value it should be any sorry any just any so so we have an input default value so we pass this input in the boss form component so we have a default value here by um, body value oh so just a default body value body value so we need to variable default body value in the post form component so says the body this body value will be in this any equal now it could be empty I think it should be string and empty the first will be empty and one we get the post value here we get the post value here post of it get post okay so when we get the post value we need to reset it this does body default body value you call will be rest dot 
sorry, just this dot parse dot body. We set the this dot part equal rest, and now we define value. Okay. Okay. Now I'm going to change it automatically refresh. Default value sim is a no property. Default value. Default value is body. Okay, so in part form, default value. Okay. Default value. Let's see. Okay, element edit default value in editor component inputs. It should be string inputs and in part form default value. Ah, sorry. Default simply we can by choice the value value and import from third type value. So go bank default body value. Now see again. Okay, so we have a set body, and now we pass value to default body value, but we didn't set set value here. Change. So how we set the default value in take editor? So now team me NCI editor. Now we on chain. Now we need to implement in a function by on chain. On chain. Okay. So we have function on chain. And see on chain. Now we need to console the slab a value, a this value, this dot value. Make sure we have a value here. And now let's see. Okay, so we have value here. So how we set the value to the risk editor here by tiny editor get content by set content. I think we will have function in set content. Editor even content even says content editor plug in editor now we search says Content. Says content. Nothing. Okay, we have a function here. Tiny NCI dot activate editor dot set content. So we have an editor here, and if it's not new or undefined this dot editor and we detect this value this dot value 
and we we need to define a function here by this set will be this set value will be bool by default it could be four now if we set the content uh, this value and um, not this dot this set value and now this dot this set value equal to and editor this dot editor dot set content set content now in set content will be here make sure everything right and this dot um, value okay now say again nothing happened console.slog this value okay so to make sure this Editor. This dot editor dot set content. Or with Tindy NCI. Tindy NCI we define it in the um, TS typing. We have a Tindy NCI here. And just copy that Tindy NCI and it then set content z dot value now make sure it works okay so nothing still happen wow 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 and the on change this dot editor Editor. Value. Activate editor. Hey, sorry, I'm back here. So I found solution here. If is a noon or if or undefined, I, I made it wrong here. If we if we detect this editor, this should be not. Okay, so this dot editor dot set content this value, it should be working fine now. It automatically. It should be automatically refresh. Here we go, you can see here, the content now will be set by default. And, and we also may change as more, as more content. More content. And update. Okay, good. Yeah, we can be at a list here and from us block also link here will be link okay so this will be link and update Oh, sling will be not display. Link will be removed by by 
Vai en kyllä edes. Voi se on tuu italiksi. No I can't help. Sorry. Shoot me. On the engine no canton. Okay, it should be who here. And try again with Ling, for example. Now refresh again. It maybe okay. So we have link here. So we have a component text editor. You can use it and copy and path to any form. And should be easy to integrate your form with the rich editor. So I hope you enjoy my video. I will see you next time. Bye for now.